Hello, I'm Kate and welcome along to this charity shop haul. Everything you're about to see was thrifted. I found it recently in charity shops in Norfolk and I've got some amazing bargains to show you. A lot of the items that I found were 50p each. So yeah, some just amazing. You can find amazing things in charity shops and sometimes they have sales so they're even cheaper. Hello Rufus, he's just wandered in. Hello Rufus, oh little cutie pie, hello. So yeah, I hope you're okay sending, Rufus is the dog by the way, in case you're like wondering, what do, what, what is that? He's just, he's on his way out again now. He's just gonna go in the landing and just watch like that. Hello, I'll get you a gravy bone in a bit, Rufus. Yes, I will, his face is just like, his ears are just perked up. And before I get into the haul, I've got to do my mug of the day. And I found this years ago, I think this is like four years, four years ago, it's a car boot sale and it was 50p, I remember the price. It's East of India and it's just a really cute little mug with a gorgeous quote on it. And it says, when it rains, look for rainbows. When it's dark, look for stars. And I just think that's a lovely, just a lovely quote, isn't it? So. I thought I would grab this and use it as my mug of the day. It's got a water in there, so we'll have that when I finish. I've got some random tulips in here. Well, not random tulips, they're like the droopy tulips. I do still, I do love a droopy tulip, but these ones are almost gone. They're at the stage where they're kind of falling off, you know, and they, the petals start falling off. So I just thought I'd put them there because um, it looked a bit bare in, in this background in the bedroom. I'm actually gonna be wallpapering this wall. So I've got some lovely wallpaper on that wall and I'm gonna continue it around. So that will hopefully be the new background soon once we get round to it. Right, so I'm gonna start with the haul. I'm gonna show you just a couple of bits here. So I've not got loads, like I said, I haven't got any clothes or anything, just some really good bargains and things you can find in charity shops. So I picked up a little bath bomb. I can't resist a little bath bomb and the packaging is so pretty and it was only a pound from Bernardo's. So it's good vibes, happy days, bath bomb strawberry scented and i got this from bernardo's as well it was only a pound as you can see there it was a pound oh see it that way yeah so a pound and i think it's from is this matalan yeah matalan originally eight pounds new actually this feels like it's brand new it doesn't feel like it's been i don't know it probably has but it's literally like something you'd buy in matalan that hasn't been used yet it's a little like um what's it called a board it's a blackboard isn't it <laughs> that's what it's called um a blackboard with some writing on so i'm going to put this in my coffee area so i've got an alcove where i have like tea not tea and coffee just have all the coffees actually and mugs on top so i'll probably put this in the alcove i've got a little um picture with with mugs on so i'll probably put this next to it or something i just thought it was really sweet and for a pound it's brilliant or i could put that in the kitchen um somewhere else so just really cute little hot chocolate sign uh, for a pound it says hot cocoa coca hot cocoa hot coca hot coca coca cocoa people say cocoa don't they but it's spelled coca i'll shut up now um but yeah it just tells you how to make a cocoa so a little sign it's got the hot chocolate and then i bought this this was in the 50p sale so I think it's just a chopping board. It's an apple chopping board, I think, pretty much what it is. Um, and I'm gonna paint this actually. So I thought this would be great painted and put in the kitchen, I think anyway, that's the plan. I could just obviously use it as a chopping board, give it a wash and then chop some stuff on it. Uh, but I, uh, I just thought that might be quite nice painted in the background or something. So I'm hoping to repaint our kitchen units. I don't know what color maybe green, but then I've gone a bit green obsessed and everything will be green, either darker green for the kitchen units or dark blue. I don't know, like a dark bluey gray. I've gone off like the pale gray. Um, so I'm gonna paint that myself, I think, to save some money. And you know, we, we got it painted about four years ago. Lee's dad painted it. So I'm gonna do it myself because uh, I just quite fancy a change. So I think either green or dark blue um, and then I can paint this, you know, and put it against the tiles or something, maybe. I don't know, it was 50p and I thought, you know what, I'll get that because I might be able to do something with it. Um, another 50p, 50, 50, 50p sale item is this little, little clean uh, picture frame. So 50p for this picture frame, I thought it'd be very nice with a wedding photo in because it's got this ivory, you know, surround that's like kind of a, 
resin resin what that's so hard to say resin thing with um silver or pearly i don't really know what it is it doesn't say where it's from but it was 50p so i thought that'd be quite nice these were 50p each these cute little i think they're tea light holders i think anyway or are they for a bulb or something so let me know so they're tulips aren't they little i love this glass this like green glass there's two of them so it'd be really pretty with the uh, tea lights in that's just the sticker i'll shove it no i won't put it put it there um i love this green glass so i think i think a tea light i don't know if you have any ideas of what that is or what it's for let me know i thought they were just so pretty i love things like this so will look great on a on a little table setting or just anywhere really on the side I do love this um I love that green glass color I've got a few um I've got a nice jug and some drinking glasses I got from cherries actually that that would go really nicely they're very pretty little tulip tea light holders or maybe a bulb or something I don't know but really pretty two of those I got this big mug, Norwich um, on a bull city. That's like the chant they do in football. Um, for Lee's dad, because he supports Norwich. I support Norwich as well. Come on, Norwich. Um, Norwich City Football Club. It looks like it's quite an old one. It's got the old logo, but who cares? They changed their logo. You probably don't know if you if you don't follow football or care about football. I didn't used to, but I love it now. And it's 50p in the sale, so I thought I'd get that and give that to... Um, Lee's dad so he can have that on match days a big cup of tea likes his cup of tea um he does like a cup of tea and then oh I've got this so this is the thing that I I saw and thought oh, I love that I'm you know gonna buy it regardless and then I found it was 50p I was like oh my goodness so this is one of those flower things um I have no idea what you call it but it's like a, a man is it a mantle vase I bought another one from the same charity shop, East Coast Hospice, and I put this really nice with tulips in. It's got handles. That's definitely a mantle vase. So I think this is as well. And how beautiful is that colour? It's like, it's green, isn't it? But it's um, it's quite bright. So it's not, I love, I love that so much. It's so nice with this pink, actually. It's really nice with this, um, this background on my wall, this colour. 50p though. Does it say anything on the bottom? Oh, it does, I'll tell you. I think it's the same make as the other thing I bought. So it's like this. It's like this. <laughs> Good description. And then you've got this metal bit inside, so you fill up with water. You can put the flowers in here so they have, you know, support and you can make some lovely things, can't you, with these? And the make is DC Stoneware, which I think is the same as the other one I've got, my white one that I love. Um, so it was said £10 on here, but it was crossed out. So I thought it was probably going to be a fiver. And then she said 50p. So I was like, oh, that is, that's just brilliant. So it's going to look gorgeous with loads of flowers popping out and some multicoloured tulips. So I just think that's gorgeous. I love the shape and I love the colour. And I was so happy I went in just at the right time. And yeah, I got that for 50p. Oh, oh sorry, little tulip things. I love that. I guess so not actually that in the middle of the mantelpiece and these on the end with little um candles in tea lights tea lights would look gorgeous love that okay and then down here i've only got a few more things to show you so i've got this serving dish which was also 50p which i couldn't believe i checked i was like is this 50p um, <laughs> probably the lady's like going to have that all day long. Is that 50p? Um, so that was, yeah, unbelievably 50p, this lovely large serving dish. And it's white and blue, which is just classic, isn't it? It's just gorgeous. Um, really pretty. There's no chips on it. So I ran my fingers all around it to check. There's no chips at all. So I have to be very careful with it. It's, um, yeah, it's so nice. And it says I make his Royal Mycin. You can see that there. So I haven't actually heard of that. I don't know where that's from. Fine China, colour, underglazed, acid detergent resistant. So I won't use my acid detergent on that. 
<laughs> it's gorgeous, isn't it? Massive big serving tray for 50p. Had eight pounds on it, but it was on the 50p, um, 50p sale place. So I'll just put that down here. And then just two more things to show you. I've got this lovely scarf, really pretty little scarf. And it's from M&S. And it was, I think it was three pounds, no, two pounds. Or oh, it's got a little thing on it. So maybe it was a pound, I'm not sure. Or maybe it was buy one, get one free or something, or buy one, get one half price. There's loads of deals on. Um, so that was one or two pounds and it's really nice. Um, it's so soft, doesn't it? Like it's been used, you know, and it's in that like perfect condition. And it's just quite a nice, simple scarf. So I've got some quite bright scarves, but I thought this was lovely. Um, and cosy and yeah so i got this i do love a scarf it doesn't smell of it. it smells new you know that like nondescript new smell doesn't smell of anything so a lovely little scarf and it's got what colors i think white and is that brown or beige so really nice i like that scarf once you put the scarf on you can't take it off and then my final item to show you in my charity shop the rifty hall is this gorgeous bag and it's exactly the type of bag I use. It's got two zips for two different compartments. The make is, I think it's Nika. It's in perfect condition. I don't know if it's been used actually. It's still got the plastic thing on here. So it might not have been used, I'm not sure, but it's, yeah, it's in perfect condition. It's pink and white with a little tag thing there. It says, follow your dreams and make today a happy day. That's cute, carry me away. That's really sweet and it's got a little is that for your is that for a trolley i don't know no i just think it's a nice thing so i love a shoulder bag so this is going to be perfect it's got loads of compartments as well so it's got a little bit of the front you could put well, whatever you want in there receipts or something i don't know and then it's got a huge compartment here and there's another one here as well so oh it's got quite a few things in this one there's a zip up bit there to put your money in oh it is new it's got the thing inside it here one of those things. You're not going to touch those, are you? So I'll wash my hands in a minute. Um, yeah, so that's the bag. I absolutely love it. Oh, so it's brand new. And it was... Oh, the thing's gone. Oh, no, it hasn't. It's here. It was £3. And I really like the little logo as well. I think that's pretty. Little Nika bag. So lovely. Really um, nice handbag. And I need to start using it, actually. I need to change my, um, my one over because it's got really filthy. You know when your bag's had its time... So I need to, I'll change it over and, and start using that one. So that is the end of the video. I really hope you enjoyed this charity shop haul. I know it wasn't like a massive, you know, a haul or with tons of things, but such great bargains. So I'm going to go and uh, take these downstairs, give everything a wash and then buy some tulips and probably put them in my tulip thing, flower with the, is that called a flower frog? I think it is. So I'm going to do something with that. I love it. So pretty. I love these little bits that I've got. And that just gorgeous so cute so yeah i'm gonna have fun with my little bits and bobs um but thank you so much for watching if you did enjoy the video give it a like and subscribe as well if you've not subscribed already let me know your favorite item pop it in the comments below i'll also link the videos that i filmed recently so i did a uh, wedding video so i showed our wedding video the like professional one i added that to last week's video and chatted more about the dress and rings and things like that so if you want to know more about our wedding and why i'm not wearing a wedding ring you have to watch last week's um video so i'll add that below plus uh the video i did before was a come shopping with me and then i'll add our uh, mauritius holiday wedding vlog as well so they'll all be linked below but thank you so much for watching i'll see you next friday at two o'clock have a great weekend and i'll see you soon Bye bye